welcome to my kitchen today's recipe is infant infant special yes that's what you are going to have today it's very simple and very tasty but before we go on please subscribe if you have not yet done so click on the bell icon like and share this video okay so i have my tilapia here now you can make use of any fresh fish of your choice but in this recipe we are going to use tilapia i've washed clean it very well so i'm going to apply salt on it the quantity depends on how you want it do you get it so i'll apply everything on it then i'm also going to sprinkle some um, seasoning on it then apply it all over and then we are going to cover and then leave it there till we are ready to use it okay mm -hmm. cover with your clench foam or any rubber you 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 want to be okay so we are going to make use of ginger garlic onion and pepper i'm going to blend them i'm adding natural um, spices to it so we are going to blend this and i'm also going to make use of tomatoes and i'm not going to slice them i'm going to blend it you can decide to slice them but typically we blend it okay so my pan on fire i'm adding my red oil to it and i'm going to add negro pepper and bay leaves to it you can omit them added onions chopped onions or sliced onions will allow it to um, fry for about three to five minutes i added a pepper mixture to it so i'll cover and give it time for it to cook for about five minutes yes yeah, so please subscribe if you have not yet done so like and share this video for me so i'll add the tomatoes to it now when it comes to fante fante we don't add thin tomatoes or tomato paste to it we don't add tomato paste it's just the fresh tomatoes that we use and we have two type of two uh, two ways of preparing in fante fante and this is one way i usually prefer this one the second method is um adding all the ingredients to the fish and then you put everything on fire when it's cooked then you add your oil to it so i added black and white pepper i'm adding a bit of seasoning a bit of salt remember i have salt on the fish do you get it mm -hmm. so we are going to cover now what i do is i make sure that the stew cooks very well so that um, I don't get too much of tomato taste in it. Because so the stew has cooked very well. And I'm going to add water to it. If you don't make your sauce a bit liquid. And it's thick and you add the fish. Your fish will be tearing. Do you get it? Mm -hmm. Because you need the water to cook the fish. And most importantly, if you don't want your fish to be tearing. You want them to be hole in the sauce then you need to make your sauce a bit liquid so this is the fish we are going to add it to the sauce mm -hmm. and so you see it's very simple very 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 simple to prepare and make sure that the saucepan you will use is a bit wide so that um it doesn't become too tight in the saucepan to the extent that you cannot even easily turn your fish and all that you get it because this you need to handle it with um care do you get it mm -hmm. so you are going to turn the fish to the other side and then give it time for it to cook please like and share this video for me leave a comment as well the more you like this video the more youtube will suggest it for other people to watch and so at this point our sauce is ready but before everything i'm going to add spring onions to sorry i said spring onions 
sliced onions to it not spring onions yes and i i like to go a little bit extra so i'm adding some cucumbers to it yes you can omit them do you get it mm -hmm. and i'm going to cover for about two to three minutes and our sauce is ready yes so you see we have our fish hole in it none of it is broken do you get it so the fish is you can leave them and everything will be fine do you get it so our, our sauce is ready you can serve with any thing you want but typically we serve this with etzel but you can serve with banku ampesi or anything so i serve this with uh, semolina mm, semolina with okro mm -hmm. semo with okro it's just like banku the semo is just like banku you can and also serve it with rice with steamed vegetables yes rice with steamed vegetables so this is it thanks so much for watching please like and share this video for me have a blessed day bye bye <laughs>